The new Brawl Stars update is here, and along with that, we're getting one new brawler, six new skins, an actual goal, and best of all, they are removing Leon. Okay, you, you got me. He's not getting removed, but Leon and a bunch of other brawlers, they're all getting balances, so some will be better, and of course, some will be worse. Now, before we dive into the full details, if you're excited for this new update, leave a like down below and comment what you want the most. So you... So you might be asking yourself, when is this new update coming out? Well, I don't have an exact date, but I'm pretty sure end of January slash early February. This update is gonna drop at the end of January. One of the things I'm most excited for are the new skins. I have all of the skins or just about all of the skins currently in the game and we're getting six new ones. So the first three are part of the Lunar New Year. In case you're uncultured like me and you have no idea when that is, the Lunar New Year is on February 5th. So on that date, we're gonna be getting three awesome skins. The first one is Brock and like, look at his missiles, dude. Oh my God. And the thing about Brock is he already has three total skins like his basic one then he has beach and then he has bling bling boy but now he's getting the fourth skin after him though we have samurai colt and i don't know about the man bun i i don't know if i dig it i'm definitely going to be using this over rockstar colt though and again one thing i want to mention about all of these skins is there's potential that all of them can have cool animations similar to how phoenix crow is regular crow throws acid phoenix crow throws fire so it does the same thing but the animation just makes it way cooler so if there's cool animations for all of these skins you best bet i'll be owning all of them now the final skin coming out on february 5th is Durrell and and I'm just happy like it's his first skin, but I feel like he just hit the mystery box, got some akimbo ray guns. I just, I don't know. Out, out of those three, Brock is definitely my favorite. If you haven't, you know, commented on the video yet, wait until we cover all six of the skins and then let me know which of those is your favorite. So the other three skins coming out throughout February, these are going to be spread out. So I don't think they're all coming at like the same time. So it's kind of like getting new content on a weekly basis. First off though, we have football bowl and I'm assuming this is for the Super Bowl, but picture like bull just, you know, shoot some people, gets his ability. He's going to look hilarious is just sprinting down the map in a full-on football suit after him we have valentine's day poco he's dressed you know in the all-white suit looking sophisticated but on top of that he has a rose and cupid's guitar to add on to this i feel like whenever he shoots instead of his you know array being green i feel like it's going to be pink with hearts one thing that's you know important to note because i am a supercell youtuber i don't have any information on this update yet but I should have some like after I'm making this video. So like right now, I'm on the same page as you watching this. So don't think, you know, I'm playing stupid for the video. I'm actually serious right now. And the final skin. <sighs> okay, you know what? This is another one. I'm not, I'm not fully feeling. <sighs> Popcorn Rico. <laughs> the dude put on some size. Oh my. Like, okay, look at regular Rico. And then where did this guy come from you know i'm not i want to say i dislike it but maybe i'm just a hater because i think poco is probably my favorite of like the second batch of skins but if rico shoots popcorn he may just take the crown <laughs> moving over to some changes coming to heist they said they revamped a few of the maps i'm assuming that's just so they play smoother again i don't know the full details on that but they also said they're introducing a new environment to heist so at the moment all of the heist maps have this this desert vibe but now we're moving on over to this new area and the skins are popping up and blocking the view so you know just kind of imagine those aren't there but as far as this you know environment goes i think it looks cool and again, I'm just excited to have something new. Here are all of the balance changes that I talked about earlier. A lot of these are kind of minuscule. Like some of them are just star power buffs. Others are attack. So kind of, you know, just read all these, take them for what they are. Honestly, Supercell could have just fixed the Leon and left like everyone the same. And I, I probably would have been happy. The, the whole community would have probably been happy, actually. Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Gene. So Gene is scheduled to come out in the middle of February, I believe. And at the moment, there's no gameplay. Um, I was looking through this video and I thought this was Gene at first. And I was like, oh my God, is this Gene? Then I realized <laughs> it's Ricochet Popcorn. 
Popcorn Ricochet. TBH? Kind of giving me Aladdin vibes. I, I don't know how it'll function. Again, I don't have dev build yet. So when I get dev build, I don't know, but I won't tell you guys. Sorry. But seriously though, close range, long range, what's his super gonna be? Is he gonna be a heavy hitter? Will he have a lot of health? There's a lot of things to take in here. So once Gene is released, I'm really excited to see how he fits into the game. Now the final things for this video are kind of miscellaneous. These were in the balance change video as well. I just didn't want to push like that new brawler segment back any further. So first off, we're going to brawl ball. You now spawn in your goal. So you don't have to worry about like the enemy taking the ball, going behind the goal, Sitting there and sitting there and just... It's so annoying. So they're finally fixing this. And on top of that, if you have like immunity, so if you just spawn in, if someone throws the ball to you, it's actually just gonna go right through you as if you were invisible. And the reason that's so clutch is because if you were playing Brawl Ball and you kill an enemy and they spawn in, sometimes they'll just like chill on the line. So when you shoot, you kind of have to throw it at them. But once these balance changes are released, if you throw the ball at someone who's immune, it's just gonna phase through them as if nothing happened. And to make the game flow even smoother, they now made shooting consume one attack. So brawlers like Mortis aren't going to be insanely overpowered, going super quick, causing all sorts of havoc. And I know some of you may be like, so they're nerfing Mortis? Didn't they just buff him in the video? So yeah, since Mortis won't be good in Brawl Ball, Supercell compensated that by actually buffing his overall stats, which could potentially make him viable in more game modes. Please, I need to rank my Mortis up and I'm bad with him. And I think there's... <laughs> One more thing I'm forgetting. You know what? It's super minuscule. Probably not even important. But we're going to be finishing. Oh, oh I remembered. Uh, if you shoot grass now, it, it won't grow back. So trim your bushes wisely. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay, you know, we're gonna wrap the video up here. Remember, if you enjoyed it, I would really appreciate that like down below. And don't forget to comment what excites you the most. Because for me, I'm really into the skins. Like, skins, they're super cool, they're just aesthetic. Since not everyone spends money on the game, it makes me look better than I actually am. But of course, the new brawler, Gene. If I can get my hands on them early, everyone will be envious of me. So I think that's what I'm looking forward to the most. But guys, this has been Eclipse. I appreciate you watching today's video and peace out.